far as we can. Whenever you're ready, please. I'm ready. Yes, yes. There you are, finally. If we should have come together, then we would have been on time. You know, I'm always late because I'm patient with the people before and I'm patient with the people after. Yeah. That's my drama. You know, I was born uh, three weeks later than my mother thought, and I think those three weeks I never got them back. <laughs> I want to ask you a question. Mm -hmm. I have the vision of me in front of me, but I would like you to describe you, and I will tell you if you're really that way. Three words will be enough. Myself, in three words, I, no, I, I need a, a little more than three words for that. That's not that simple. Huh? What can I say? You know, first of all, I have no opinion. Huh? I'm never happy with myself. Uh, I would give you, of course, a very flattering description, but I'm not sure I will believe. It's more to make believe other people. You know, I don't deliver a description of my person. You have what you see, that's all. There's nothing behind. Huh? How do we do to stay fresh and relevant? Because if I see you, I think we are quite fresh and relevant. What's your opinion? A question I never asked myself. Huh? I have no idea if there's a secret of your or our success. I have problems formulating that, but maybe you are better with words than I am. There's no secret. The only secret is work. Huh? Huh? We'll get your act together. Huh? There are not so many secrets. And also perhaps a decent life. Huh? Don't drink, don't smoke, don't take drugs, all that helps. Huh? One survives better. Huh? So uh, I don't think it's not that complicated. It depends how much you want to do what you do. If you think your life, whatever it is, is more important than your work, uh, then there may be a, pr a problem. But don't complain. Don't think you're a victim of the system. I don't believe in that at all. If somebody in this business thinks he's a victim of the system, that is, he is not in the, real, in the real job, he should be in another job. Huh? If the pressure is too big, do something else. What do you think about the word muse? And do we have a muse? Or do we have muses? I hate that word. Huh? Uh, because there is something not really nice in the world. I like to be surrounded by girls who are inspiring, but the word muse is very limited. And then uh, you cannot answer on giving one name because in fashion you have to dress everybody. So you need all kinds of muses. It's the attitude, the spirit, the approach to life and fashion. But they don't have to be fashion freaks, huh? because fashion freaks are not too crazy for. Is humor really important to us? It's all normal for me. I don't, you know, I don't say now I do this, I do this. It comes the way it comes. I never prepare anything. What I say was, it's all improvised. I'm a totally improvised person, but very professional improvisation. Uh, I want to ask you a question you may have forgotten, and I don't remember. Uh, when fashion appeared in your mind as a possibility for a future? You know, it's not a decision, it was more something I wanted. I was always interested in what people wear, myself included. But you know, as a child, you don't know. The world of fashion is something very far away, especially in those days. It's not like today with all the TVs. Fashion was completely uh, another world, something, uh, I don't know, in the stars, uh, zillions of light years away from the world, especially from my world, from my childhood, from my, in the country. But uh, circumstances made it that it happened. Uh, tell me why you think Netapote is so interesting today? Today, it's about everything is about technology. The world has changed. Eh? Also, in terms of communication, then in terms of, of, of working, creating materials, manufacturing, everything has changed. I mean, this is the most important thing today. Eh? So, uh, I never talk about the good old days, but I'm not sure they were that good, uh, just old. And uh, I think it's very exciting. Everything I had known before interests me more than everything I had seen in my life. I pretend I haven't seen the collection, so can you talk a little about it? You know, it's difficult to, to describe a spirit of a collection when it concerns yourself. Uh, I don't describe myself either. It's just what I feel in terms of what I think uh, is right for my vision of the car line. I don't make an analysis with words because I do it by instinct, you know. Being myself is not that difficult. <laughs>
You want a really stupid question, because sometimes in interviews you get this kind of question, what a woman can do to be really chic. You know that commonplace? You know, if you come and ask me, I want to be chic, there's little hope to become chic. Huh? Because there are peasants in country who are beyond chic in their poor rags, and very rich women who are not chic in the most expensive dress. So, you know, the minute you ask the question, in fact, there is only an answer to be polite, but the real problem is somewhere else. Another question. I have an answer for that, but I would like your answer. If you have to own one thing, what that should be? Knowing your taste, this question is very difficult. It depends on the body. Huh? Today, you know, it is the same thing for men and, and women. A white shirt, jeans, uh, and, and a jacket, whatever it is, a blazer, whatever. These are the three basic things with a t-shirt that is what everybody needs. And there is no even any gender problem. Huh? I will not say what you need is a cocktail dress. There are not so many cocktails in life anymore. Huh? There is this very banal question I like to ask you, knowing you, so it's more difficult to, uh, to answer. What would you take with you on a desert island? I prefer not to go there, but that's not my problem. It depends on the climate, where the island is. Okay, I have another question I could answer myself, but I'd like to ask you, what is your idea of a perfect day. Every day should be perfect. It's up to you to work uh, on it and to make the day perfect. Huh? There is no perfect day and you know, it would be a very sad thing because a day has only 24 hours and how will be the next day? Huh? Up to you to make every day as perfect as possible. It's a question of will and discipline. Are you easily bored and especially now? What a strange question. Even if I waited a long time for myself, what can we do now? Ça va? Yeah. <laughs>